What's up, everybody? It's Hazel2012 here with you again. And I got some gameplay today on Overlord using the Remington. And this thing hits like a fucking beast. It is uh, reminiscent of the Scar from Modern Warfare 2. Somebody else actually said that too, and I agree with them. Uh, it is accurate as hell. I mean, watch me pick this guy off. Just headshot, ping. And I did some work with it. Ended up going 22 and 8. I found it a lot harder to get higher scoring games like those 30 and 40 bombs that I dropped pretty regularly in Black Ops 2. I'm, I'm finding it harder to get those in uh, in Ghosts. The map size, uh, the way people play, the hit detection and everything. It's going to take some getting used to. It's going to take some serious, some serious getting used to uh, dropping so quick and learning all of the maps. But you know, the game's only been out a couple of weeks. But I do have a couple of things I want to talk about today real quick. Uh, first and foremost, I did get to uh, play Ghosts on a PS4 tonight. And over at a friend's house, my friend Rob, went over there to watch some UFC fights and decided, hey man, you got a PS4, I'm going to try Ghosts out on it. And played it a little bit. <clears throat> it was a lot of fun. I mean, I can't say that the game looked a whole lot different or a whole lot better, but what did look better was just wow it was awesome the textures and and color and grass trees the ground everything just looked so much more realistic and the detail was so much better in it that you can definitely tell that this game was meant to be played on a next generation console and it kind of excites me to uh, to pick one up and i'm still kind of up in the air about which system i'm going to get first granted the playstation 4 is hundred dollars cheaper but the problem I run into now is that I have an Xbox 360 and I bought ghosts for it uh, so if I want to go to the PlayStation 4 I can't just get an upgrade I've got to buy the game again so that's 60 bucks so that means the PS4 is now four hundred and sixty dollars and granted I'll probably get some trade-in value on ghosts for Xbox 360 but still then I have to pay for the online for the PS network which is a 50 bucks which puts it at five hundred and ten dollars so now I'm at the same price as paying for an Xbox One. And I already have my Xbox Live membership on the uh, Xbox 360 that will carry over. <laughs> so I'm still kind of up in the air. I want to get both. And I know that Carlos and Killa and all those guys that you know I talk to on a regular basis that you know do some work with me on YouTube and they're good friends. Uh, they're all you know trying to you know bring me to the dark side. And they're going to. It's going to happen. I want one. I want both of them. But I think I'm just going to have to end up getting the uh, get, getting the Xbox One first. And some something else I want to talk about. This is a late night commentary, so don't mind me if I ramble a little bit. This is only about a five minute video, but you know I want to sit here and I want to talk about something real quick. Uh, I posted a video a couple of days ago, and I tagged Apocalypse in it. And I tagged Infinity Ward and Activision Support. And it was a hacked lobby that I found in Domination. And if you guys haven't checked that out, of course, I'll, I'll leave a link or something like that. Or do some magical ninja stuff in there and put it there. But it, that, for me, that video has gotten a lot of views and a lot of support. And I gained a lot of, uh, a lot of new subscribers because of that video. And I want to thank you guys for subscribing and checking me out. And also, I want to thank the Schwantz27 for giving me a shout out on his video. He uh, sent some of his people my way, and they've started watching some videos and commented and stuff. So thanks, guys, for coming over from there. Schwantz, you're a good guy. No matter how much of an asshole you seem to make yourself out to be, you're a good guy. Uh, and, and real quick, before I get out of here, because this game's almost over with, it's it's kind of, you know, 65 time limits, a little different. I'm used to that Black Ops 2 100 kill confirm limit. But... Uh, I just want to say that I'm having a lot of fun with Ghosts, and there's a lot of hate going around on it, and there's a lot of people talking OP this and OP that. But guys, just play the game and enjoy it and have fun. I'm having fun with it. I'm having fun playing with my friends. I'm having fun posting the videos. I'm getting a lot of good support from you all, and I can't thank you enough. I'm almost at 200 subscribers, and I'm I'm working on it, man. I'm, I'm really working to try to get up there. So thank you all for the likes, the, the favorites, the shares, everything. I do greatly appreciate it. And this is a 22-8 and 8 game on Overlord. I'm not, still not sure how I feel about this map, but it's not too bad. It could be worse, I guess. But thank you guys for watching. You guys have a good night. Take it easy. Thanks a lot.